Hey guys, as you can see, I'm in a new location. I'm in my Swansea home. I've just finished my first week of semester two of year two um, at university. It's the first week, it's been quite fun. There's going to be a lot of hard work coming up. So over the next couple of weeks, I'm probably not going to be able to vlog very much. Um, but yeah, let's just see how it goes. So my eczema is finally cleared up, which means I can wear makeup once again. Yay! And um, I have a new hairdo which I'm not quite sure if I like yet. It's been a very long time since I haven't had um, sort of a fringe or bangs, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, it's quite weird. The reason why I'm recording in Swansea today is because I'd quite like to show you my new wall that I have put up. The first semester when I moved in, I put loads of photos of all me and my friends and all my family and rabbits and I've changed the wall around, it's kind of there now. But this is now my achievement wall. Um, I have a poster of me and Patches from Prelim 1 and um, I think that was just before we were going in because I look absolutely petrified. Um, the instructions for life that were written by the Dalai Lama that I do sort of live by quite a lot and my little baby boy called Tinker who um, I fell in love with when I was working with the RDA at Coiti and he is now in a new RDA location um, and everyone's fallen in love with him apparently but he still loves his food which is just as usual. And of course by the way I have some rosette this video has got absolutely nothing to do with the equine or horses because I thought I'd do a little bit something more fun and plus I really don't have anything to talk about. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do like, I'm going to be a copycat and do what loads of people are doing which is the Google meme video. I didn't kind of want to do these videos but I kind of googled my name and some of the results were quite funny so I thought I'd share them. It's called the Google verb meme video and if anyone doesn't know Basically, you Google your name plus a verb, and pretty much it goes a little bit like this. Sarah looks like... Sarah looks like a horse. That is kind of an insult, but it could be worse. I guess I do have a big nose and I do have a long face. I don't have a tail though, or... Oh, I do have big ears. That's another thing I have that horses have. But, okay, yeah, I guess I look like a horse. Sarah likes... Sarah likes you. I do, you little heart. Sarah likes it hard. You can take that whatever way you wish. I'm not adding comment to that. Sarah eats. Sarah eats souls. But I only had one soul available, like at Swansea, all my souls are at home that I eat. And I kind of had a big lunch, so I'm just going to have the one soul. Oh, God. Sarah eats the alphabet. I think I prefer reading the paper. Oh, well, why would a food could be that? That's disgusting. Sarah wears, Sarah wears Prada. I wish. Sarah loves, Sarah loves that someone special in her life. It probably comes to you as a massive shock that I don't actually have someone special in my life. Surprisingly, earlier in the video, you'll be surprised because I'm clearly such a classy person. However, a while ago, I did think I'd met my knight in shining armour. However, he just turned out to be a twat in tinfoil. Sarah loves flowers. It is true, I love roses. I love the strawberry ones, the caramel ones, the ones with the hazelnut and the caramel. I just love roses so, so much. Sarah needs. Sarah needs to get a life. I don't think it's very nice that Google told me that I need to get a life. Like, that is quite insulting. But anyway, I've got the upper hand because I went on to Amazon and to play and neither stock life. Sarah needs to bake a cake. I do quite enjoy making cakes. However, my housemate, who is also called Sarah, likes making cakes and does make very nice cakes. And she made my birthday cake, which is this one. And it was a very lovely cake. And I think we all ate it within like a week. It was really, really nice. Sarah needs to get a job. Yes, I am in dire need of a job that is legal, high paid, and has got at least one hot guy that I'll be working with. There. Sarah says, Sarah says, what will be, will be. What will be, will be. Sarah wants, Sarah wants to know Chuck's secret. I think this was a reference to Chuck the TV series, because um, I don't know any Chuck apart from Chuck Norris. And I'm surprised Google would allow you to sort of type anything about Chuck Norris' secrets because you know how secret they are. Sarah wants to find true love. I found true love with Stitch. You love me, don't you, Stitch?
Sarah does, Sarah does yoga. Okay, for a fact, Sarah does not do yoga. Sarah will not do yoga, has never done yoga, and never will do yoga. End of. The only yoga pose I know is down dog, which I often say to my friends is an insult. Sarah does not smile. How can I not smile? Sarah hates... Sarah hates your movies. I'd just like to say, if Ben Stiller's watching this, that's aimed at you. Every Ben Stiller film I have gone to see, I have gone out even more confused than when I went in, because I have no idea how this guy gets work. Sarah asks... Sarah asks for donations. There is a fund that I set up a year and a half ago. It's not really a charity. Um, but we're always looking for donations, for people to give any type of donation that they can spare. If you have any spare change, you know, whether a couple of quid or a couple of pence that you could spare, that would be really great if you could send it into the fund. The fund is called Help Sarah Go to Oceana and Wine Street Weekly. And I can promise you from the bottom of my heart that every penny that goes into the fund helps me go to Wine Street or Oceana on a Monday or Wednesday and get absolutely smashed. So that is all for now, my lovelies. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video as much as I have it recording it. Um, I've just kind of realised like all my housemates are in, so they heard me screaming, shouting, swearing because I can't do clips right, and I'm choking on a piece of paper. So yeah, it's probably been really fun. So I have to go and explain what the hell was going on for the last, I think about an hour and a half, and um, I shall see you when I see you.